Yo, what is going on guys? It's Cryptic TMG and I'm back with a brand new video. And today I want to share with you guys something that I changed that improved my lap times immediately. And that is getting rid of the Delta in the top left hand corner. You know, the thing that you always look at when you're on a good lap, whether it shows where you're up on a lap and sometimes it can just break your concentration. Now, I got the idea from this from watching Alexander Smolia and also previously watching James Baldwin. If you don't know who them guys are, Alexander Smolia is someone who sim races but is also a F3 driver and we all know James Baldwin who's competed in loads and loads of different sim games plus being able to do it in real life in British GT and also doing the Spa 24 hours so those guys have a ton of experience and I noticed watching those guys that sometimes they do not have the Delta in the top left hand corner. Now this is a lap from um, LFM that I was on the other day and you know, I, I knew I was on a lap. I knew I was going quicker. I just glanced up at the time and it ended up putting me off. And this has happened to me so many times. It's unbelievable. So many times I've been in a good lap and I've just glanced, just double checked the Delta time and instantly been put off. Now, I ended up turning it off. And I decided, you know what? I'm going to go and do uh, a few hot laps and see what I can do with just no Delta in the top left hand corner at all. Um, I didn't manage to save the lap, but I did save the replay. So I'm going to play the replay for you now. And what ended up happening was, is I ended up just doing back to back laps, all of them faster than the times I'd been going before during the whole week where I was doing LFM. And um, these conditions were actually warmer than what I was doing for the LFM races. The LFM race, I think, was like 11 11. So it was really cold, really cool. And um, I think my fastest lap, even in the LFM practice servers up until when I tried this was like a 59.8 and instantly you know your, your focus just completely changes when you have no delta I was no longer looking whether I was up on a lap or not I was just focusing on just doing the lap you know so many times when you know you're on a good lap you either underdrive it or overdrive it what I mean is sometimes you might get to a last sector you know you're on a good lap you can see the delta and because you know you're on such a good lap, you don't quite attack the last chicane like you would because you don't want to mess the lap up. Or vice versa, you might be on a lap that is slightly, slightly up and you want to gain so much time through the last corner that you just completely utter send it. But you, you do too much and then you end up messing up the lap or you end up, you were three temps up, you end up only a tenth and a half up. And I could show you plenty of cases where this happened to me. Um... Well, I was on a good lap and I just did too much in the last sector, the last few corners, trying to gain that extra time. And I end up going from like half a second up to only like two temps up and just, you know, not maximizing your potential. But me turning off the Delta time just completely changed everything. I went from doing like 59 eights. I end up doing like a 59 three, a 59 two, a 59 six. And then finally, I think I did a, a 59 zero. And I was like, all in the space of literally 10 minutes, just doing laps and completely and utterly just not focusing on the Delta. And I think from now on, that might be the way forward for me. I definitely feeling like I might just turn it off completely when it comes to qualifying laps. I'm not too sure about races yet because it, I just, I don't know. I'm just so stuck and used to just looking at the Delta time. And I think most people are. But for me, because I know that Alexander Smolia and and Baldwin, they've raced in the real world. And I believe, you know, in the real world, you've got to have so much focus on your laps and, you know, being as accurate as you can and being as consistent as you can. You kind of, you don't want the Delta to distract you. And I actually find that it, it can be quite distracting. I don't know how many of you guys try it or how many of you guys don't actually use a Delta. But for me, I tried it and I'm someone who, I've been relying on Delta since since I've been playing um racing games you know all the way back to f1 right when i was playing that online from like 2010 or whatever i've always 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 loved the delta but i've noticed when you do turn it off you do find that you're able to micromanage your laps so much better and what i mean is you're able to focus in on the points where you knew you was weak and you, you can actually just concentrate on on your lap you concentrate on every part of your lap and it just seems to wield time I tried it. I couldn't believe within I start. I started. I think my first two laps were pretty much the same as what I was doing already. And then after that, boom, literally just half a second quicker, six tenths quicker. And then by the end, I was doing 59 zero. I was like, what the hell? And it was like it felt easy. It didn't feel like I was 
had to stress to do it. It just felt so easy just to do the lap times. And yeah, I, I couldn't believe it. And then I felt like, let me just try it in some other cars. I went, I jumped in the Audi, same thing. With the Audi, I was doing, I think I was doing like 59, what was it, 59.8, I think was my fastest in the Audi. I jumped in the Audi, literally within two laps, I was already at like a 59.5. So I was like, wow, this is not even a good circuit for me. So for me to instantly jump in the Audi and be able to straight away just go quicker, it definitely changed my perception on how much I'm focusing on the Delta times and stuff that I don't need to be focusing on that could possibly be slowing down your laps. Um, and I think for the, the likes of consistency as well, it's kind of like we see it in the real world. Back in the day, remember you used to see Nico Rosberg. He didn't want to know the, the time Delta to the cars behind or, or, or whatever. He just wanted to solely focus on his job on the racetrack and I feel like unless you're one of them people that can really multitask and do loads of different things at once you see some guys probably like like Jardy Jardy is an example where he can do multiple things at once and still produce you know good lap times but for some people especially for like myself I, I kind of need minimal distractions <laughs> to, to, to really bang the laps out and if you're someone like me I think you should definitely give it a try man like do a bunch of laps with, with your Delta Ron, right? That's what I did. Do a bunch of laps with a Delta Ron and then just complete, just turn it off and see how you go, man. I'm telling you, it, it definitely makes a difference for me personally. Unless, unless like, as, as I said, unless you're someone who can just focus on multiple things, you don't really, it doesn't really phase you, then by all means, carry on what you was doing. But I'm telling you, man, it made a difference to the way how I was ending my laps, the way how I wouldn't lose focus because I didn't know whether I was up or not. All I knew is that, okay, I've nailed every corner and I'm just going to keep on pushing. And I didn't, I ended up just not overdriving. I ended up just not overdriving any of the corners. And when I made a mistake, it was generally because I just made the mistake, not because I was looking at the Delta thinking, damn, I need to, I need to make up a tenth hair or I need to gain a tenth hair or I, I need to make sure I don't mess this up. And the, the mental side of racing is, is actually a lot more important than you think man so um guys give it a try anyway it's cryptic tmg like and subscribe hit the notification bell to catch my videos first and tell me what times you were able to achieve once you tried this man i would, I would love to know but anyway guys peace